I now request those present to rise and observe a minute of silence in memory of the late president. A moment of silence in his memory. Sir Ketumila Masire later lauded as a leader who steered Botswana from the lower ranks of the least developed state to its place today as a stable middle income country. He became a newspaper editor, a political visionary, a finance minister, a president and a peacemaker. In each and every role, it was clear his primary objective was to advance the development of his people, his country and his region. It is in no small part due to the wise and able leadership of Sir Ketamele that Botswana has become a model for advancing democracy and economic development. He devised and implemented far-sighted policies which guided Botswana since attaining its freedom half a century ago. Sir Ketumili's focus on people-centered development, particularly in health and education, helped enable Botswana to make remarkable progress in the years since independence. Botswana is recognized as a model of good governance with an established, strong constitutional and democratic tradition. Well, would you like to put me? He was praised for his mediation efforts in countries like Kenya, Rwanda and Congo, while his work placing Botswana on a path to development has won him global acclaim. His country's ambassador to the UN with the final word. Sir Kitumile was a distinguished statesman and clearly one of Africa's best leaders. He touched many lives, both within Botswana and outside Botswana, and was a, a source of inspiration to all who cherish freedom, democracy, respect for human rights, and the rule of law. Sir Ketumile Masire was buried at his birthplace of Kanye late last month. Sherman Bricepe's SABC News, New York.